Spider-Man's got some new tricks up his sleeve with the Spider-Man Triple Action Web Blaster. Three ways to shoot webs, water, and missiles. Now all in one. Just pop in the water blasting tank and everyone gets soaked. Pop and lock in the missile blaster for rapid fire missile action. Bullseye! Can you handle more? Those aren't the kind of web blasters we're talking about here. Anyways, welcome back to Weavers and all you spectacular Spidey fans to another really exciting Spider-Man PS4 related video. So even though April is over with Game Informer's coverage relating to getting actual gameplay and solid information about the game itself for Spider-Man PS4, we actually have really awesome updates in regards to the merchandise that we can get for the game. Now, of course, as you already know, there's basically three different versions of Spider-Man PS4 that you can buy. First off is the standard physical edition, second off is the digital deluxe edition, and third off is the one I'm getting is the collector's edition. However, today on May 5th, we actually have a really awesome update to more items that are going to be released for Spider-Man PS4 from GameStop. And first of all, huge shout out to Ronnie Pugs for actually discovering this news in the first place, and he did a video about this topic as well, so please go check it out and support him as much as you can. So of course, as you should already know, GameStop are known to get lots of awesome exclusives when it comes to these big upcoming games, and of course, the one thing that we have seen already are the Spider-Man PS4 Funko Pops. Now, alongside of all the Spider-Man PS4 Funko Pops being only exclusive to GameStop, we now have an official showcase of the collector's box for Spider-Man PS4. Now, this is not meant to be confused with the collector's edition for Spider-Man PS4, but this is rather a whole box of merchandise for Spider-Man PS4 that you can get at your local GameStop. And all of the items that are showcased within the collector's box is extremely cool. And if you personally want to pre-order this bad boy for yourself, I'm going to leave a link in the description to GameStop's website so you can go and buy it quickly. So the description for the collector's box states, get the ultimate Spider-Man experience with the limited edition GameStop exclusive Marvel Spider-Man collector box. The collector Collector's box is packed with seven exclusive items, including home goods, wearables, accessories, and more with a combined value of over $100. And even better, GameStop goes on to fully identify each of the items within the box. So of course, the main item that stands out the most to me and the one that stands out the most in this picture is of course the flap-styled backpack of Empire State University, which of course is Peter's College in the game. So what we've seen already relating to Empire State University is of course Brian Intar wearing an ESU shirt back at D23 in 2017, but now it's awesome that we're actually going to be able to get an ESU back backpack with this collector's box, which looks sweet. So of course, the next item to showcase off in this picture, which is in front of the backpack, is the insulated travel mug. So this insulated travel mug is different from the stainless steel water bottle that we actually saw within the Game Informer gear page. So it's really cool to see that you can have the option of either getting the travel mug or the stainless steel water bottle, but both of which look great. Now, of course, the next item on the list, which is right next to the travel mug, is a Watchman beanie of Spider-Man PS4 with an awesome white spider logo and a red and blue background. And sadly, beanies never look really good on me, but if I'm cold one day, you know for a fact I'm going to be wearing this bad boy everywhere. And the next item on the list, which is right next to the beanie, is a Spider-Man PS4 Spiral Notebook. And I personally just love how vibrant that image is of Spider-Man, and I know for a fact I'm going to be writing in that thing 24-7, which is awesome. Now moving on to the last item that comes with the collector's box is the collectible Enamol pin. Now if you pre-order the digital deluxe edition for Spider-Man PS4, you're actually going to get an awesome physical pin of Spider-Man himself. But if you pick up this collector's box, you're just going to get a pin of the white spider symbol, which just looks epic. Now since that wraps up all the items that we can actually see that comes in this collector's box, we actually have two other mystery items that you're going to obtain within the box itself. But, as you can see, GameStop aren't ready to reveal what they are just yet. Now, sadly, I can't make out what the item on the right of the mystery items are, but some people are actually saying that it could be a pumpkin bomb, which I think is a really good guess. However, I can almost guarantee you that the item that looks like Spider-Man's hand is actually going to be a wearable web shooter. And the reason why I say I can guarantee you is because we've actually had kind of confirmation about this already in the past few months from Jacinda Chu. So, just Jacinda Chu actually implied all the way back in January of 2018 that we were going to get a merchandise item of web shooters from Spider-Man PS4. And this is because Spidey Squad co-founder Vigilante Spider tweeted out one day saying, Insomniac Games, I need these bracelet web shooters. These are so cool and beautiful. And by the way, Jacinda Chu loved the idea that it looks like a Fitbit. Very clever. And Jacinda actually replied to Vigilante Spider by saying, I actually had them designed by an industrial designer in case they get manufactured. Hint, hint to all the marketing folk. Hopefully, we can release the concept art someday for the enterprising cosplayer. And George Jordan Morrison actually replied to that tweet by saying, If we do get merchandise, what do you think we'll get? Or do you know if we are getting any merchandise? And Jacinda awesomely replied to Jordan by saying, I just focus on the game, but I do get requests for reference if marketing decides to manufacture something, so I think about what stuff I like as a fan when designing things. Web shooters and plushies are high on my list. What are yours? And just knowing how that one item is almost definitely going to be a wearable web shooter just makes me super emotional. I just can't wait to get my hands on them. But anyways, guys, that's all the news I have for you today. This collector's box 
looks looks absolutely amazing and i just can't wait to buy one for myself but anyways guys thank you all so much for watching let me know all your thoughts in the comment section down below what is your favorite item within the collector's box even though i personally love the web shooters i think my personal pick would have to go with the esu backpack but anyways guys thank you all so much for watching stay spectacular spy fans peace out Pop in the web blaster and shoot tons of crime busting web. Loads of web blasting action for maximum satisfaction. Water blasting, missile blasting, and web blasting all in one. Triple the action, triple the fun. The Spider Man Triple Action Web Blaster. <laughs> <laughs>